And now, KITV4 Weather. Hey, welcome to Weather Now. We are enjoying some beautiful sunrises, sunsets, and moonrises. Here's a shot it sent in from Don Libby. Of course, you can upload yours to the local section of our website, KITV.com. It's going to be another great night out there to snap a photo of our sundown because very dry, stable conditions. Overnight to early morning is when we're most active and really didn't pick up too much. In fact, as of 2 a.m. this morning, only four 100s for both Oahu as well as Honau now, and that'll continue to decrease into the day. Our rain forecast model, which you can track any time online. The only time that we'll have an enhanced chance of showers, if you look at the timestamp here in the late day for Saturday, a little bit more moisture comes over the central part of the state. But still, nothing heavy. Everything remains on the lighter scale. Again, you can track that model anytime online at KITV.com. For our surf, this is where it's at double overhead for the north facing shores, three to seven, maybe an occasional plus for the south and west. We're going to re enforce that town areas Tuesday, Wednesday with another moderate size swell and then two very large north to northwesterlies Sunday through Wednesday going to keep hanging on there for the north facing shores possibly near advisory levels of 15 foot faces high tide in the four o'clock hour 1.4 and as far as you mariners well no marine warnings we do have three to six foot wind waves knots out of the east northeast at 15 and a southwest swell due in at three feet a northwest in three to five feet so there is a mixed bag there and it looks all good for all facing shores. Now our sundown is going to happen at 626 with our UV index down to 10. Still very high level of exposure. It's going to be a lot of sun out there. Very hot. Those UV rays beaming down. So do what you can to protect your skin. But um, other than that, we're just going to have to get creative to stay cool because very light trades are going to shift to Kona soon. 83 the high for Kahuku. 85 for Waimanalo. Likely to feel much warmer than that. So you can hit the surf. Crank up the AC. Do what you want to stay cool. 82 the high for Lana a city over to the island of Hawaii. We've got a little bit of haze out there for the Kailua Kona side, and that's pretty much the question statewide. Are we going to get that fog in the picture? Well, at least through Sunday, that should not be the case, though we are still going to deal with humid conditions. The best chance of fog coming into the picture is going to be the start of next work week when uh, things just remain light and variable. It's going to be a very light southeasterly flow. Trades, we might feel those come back sometime Thursday and Friday of next week.